Turn with me to your Bible. Let me share with you from the Word of God. It's so good to have you here. We pray the Lord's Spirit has ministered to you this morning. We can share from God's Word. Now in the book of Matthew, chapter 21, if you will, verse 8 through 16. Matthew chapter 21, verse 8 through 16. Don't let me get too loud. My ears have, I have for almost a month now, about like living in a drum. Can't hardly hear it. If I get too loud, you have to turn me down. Matthew chapter number 21, verse 8 through 16. My Lord, I feel the Holy Spirit of God. Yes. Yes. Read with me if you will. And a very great multitude spread their garments in the way, and others cut down branches from their trees and straw them in the way. And the multitudes that went before, so that followed, cried, saying, Hosanna to the Son of David. Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. And when he was coming to Jerusalem, all the city was moved, saying, Who is this? And the multitude said, This is Jesus, the prophet of Nazareth of Galilee. And Jesus went into the temple of God and cast all them out that sold and bought in the temple, overthrew the tables of all the money changers, the seats of them that sold doves, and said to them, It is written, that My house shall be called the house of prayer. But you have made it a den of thieves. And the blind and the lame came to him in the temple and healed them. When the chief priests and scribes saw the wonderful things that he did, and the children crying in the temple and saying, Hosanna to the son of David, they were sore displeased and said to him, Hearest thou what these say? Jesus said to them, Yea, have you never read out of the mouth of babes and sucklings, thou hast perfected praise? Yeah. 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 Have you never read out of the mouth of babes and sucklings, uh -huh. thou hast perfected praise? I want you to understand that Jesus is making that triumphal to entry into Jerusalem. Yes. Or he's coming into Jerusalem. Headed to the old rugged cross. Yeah. Not long off. But while he's on his way, the word said multitudes begin to go before him and praise and honor him, crying, Son of David, Hosanna, the Lord cometh. Yeah. And they began to worship. And the word said that many told them to cease from their praise and worship. Jesus said, but if these cease their praise in me, the stones would cry out immediately and bring praise to my man. Yes. The Bible said that God inhabits the praises of his people. Amen. 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 Jesus coming to Jerusalem there as they were seen. Then he comes into the Jerusalem. And while he's in the temple. The Bible said, and the children, as he began to heal, the children began to sing praises yes. and say, Hosanna yes. to the Lord. Yes. Yes. Praise his name yes. who cometh in the name of the Lord. Yes. And as they began to praise him one more time, the high priest and scribe began to say, Hear! What the children are saying. Come on. Yeah. Amen. And Jesus quoted Psalms 8 and 2. Hast thou not read out of the mouth of babes and sucklings? Huh? Yeah, thou hast perfected strength. That's right. Praises unto me. Yes. Bless that you. word praise from the Greek word means to thoroughly be complete. Yes. Both. It's derived from another Greek word that says with intensity. Yes. In other words, that word perfected means thoroughly, completely, with intense yes. 
Praise the Lord. I want to preach to you today on children with perfected praise. Children with perfected praise. Would you pray with me as we preach just for a few moments? Share with you with what God is already doing and ministering in this house today. Would you pray with me? Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I come today and pray, Lord, that the blessings of our God be upon these words that we speak today. Without you, Holy God, we're nothing. But we come to honor you and give you praise and honor and glory. For in Jesus' mighty name, we ask all these things. Yes, And we thank you for them. Thank you, Lord. The church said amen. Amen. Children with perfected praise, completely thorough, intense praise. Yeah. The Bible said in the book of 2 Samuel, the word said that David came into Jerusalem carrying, bearing the Ark of the Covenant. That's right. They went and brought it back to the house of God, and as they were there, the word said that David danced before the Lord with all of his might. As he began to sing and praise and magnify God with intensity, he began to share the great love that he had for God as he walked into Jerusalem. And he began to dance before God. Do you know the Bible said that we need to worship God on the high symbols that we are to praise Him with songs and with dancing and rejoicing in the Lord. Amen. God, as the Spirit of God begins to move us, we begin to worship Him and we begin to magnify the great and mighty name of Jesus. Amen. He's worthy today to receive all praise and glory that we give out to him today. Amen. Yeah. Amen. The Lord says he coming to Jerusalem as they begin to sing Hosanna. Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. The son of David. The word of God said they recognize who the Lord is. Yeah. Yes. Pray I'm telling you today we recognize who he is. Amen. That he is the Lord of glory. Yeah. He's the king of glory. And we come to church not to exalt some man. We don't come to church to elevate some individual. But we come to the house of God because we recognize who he is. We come to honor him and lift him up. Amen to God. But the Bible said, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men unto me. Can I hear somebody say that? We have become too silent. In this blood bought church, this redeemed church of Christ, we have become too silent and allowed yeah. obnoxious, yeah. contemptible world we live in. Yeah. Who looks at Jesus in this state in disgust, and we as a church back up in a corner, and we yeah. just become silent. But it's time we move to the forefront and begin to praise Him. Psalms 48 and verse 1. I like what 
David said. He said, great is the Lord and greatly to be praised in the city of our God, in the mountains of his holiness. Can somebody shout amen? That's why we come to church and rejoice. That's why we praise him. We know who he is. He is the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. The word said in the book of Jeremiah. Jeremiah was speaking here and he's talked about being healed and being saved. In Jeremiah 17 and 14, he said, The Lord's healed me. The Lord saved me. For the Lord is my praise. For the Lord, He is. My praise. As one of the children who have perfected praise, we cannot be silent. We cannot hang our heads down and be quiet in this, in this world that we live today. The devil will intimidate you and make you feel like you're a fool for getting emotional. My God, I got a right to get emotional. Oh. 